It's Volkswagen Tigan. Tigan? Hey guys, welcome back to Invictus Motors, and today I get to review this beautiful Volkswagen Tiguan. The Volkswagen Tiguan is a compact crossover SUV. Now, Volkswagen actually first released these in 2007, and the name is a blend of two words and two animals, a tiger and an iguana, hence the name Tiguan. This car is finished in a beautiful deep black pearl paint, which is complemented by these gorgeous looking 19 inch alloy wheels, which are in a nice dark gray sort of color. Now all of, this is, all of this fits so well with the chrome package. If you come down here, you'll see this car has got a lovely chrome all around it, which just really just makes the car stand out and look really classy towards other cars. In the front of this car now, you'll see that Volkswagen have put a lot of detail into their lights. These lights have a crazy amount of different things that they can do. They, these are automatic LED headlights with dynamic headlight range control. These are cornering lights, meaning when you turn the car, the lights will turn with them. And they are, also have daytime running lights, meaning the car looks really, really good whilst you drive along in the daytime. Down at the front of the car, you'll see that this Volkswagen badge is actually more than what meets the eye. Now, this badge is a forward collision warning system, which will tell the car if there is another car in front and you're about to collide with someone. Now, it also comes with autonomous braking, meaning the car will emergency brake if another car is going to collide with it. When parking the car in a tight spot, you'll notice that this Tiguan comes with closing uh, mirrors, which I'll just demonstrate to you here. These mirrors are also heated, so in the uh, winter, you won't have a problem if they get all frosted up or steamed up, you'll be absolutely fine. So this car has heated uh, washer nozzles, meaning in the winter, they won't freeze up, allowing you to clean your windscreen. Uh, the car also has front and rear parking sensors, making life so much easier when you're trying to park in a tight multi-storey multi car park. So as you can see, this Tiguan comes with a gorgeous looking panoramic roof. Now the panoramic roof allows more light into the car, so when you're driving along, you've got more visuals and uh, whoever's in the back can enjoy looking out stargazing. Getting inside this car now, you'll see this gorgeous looking Safrano orange leather interior, which is two-tone with the black alongside with it. The car also comes with a multifunctional steering wheel, meaning you can control everything from just from the click of a button. Now, personally, I really like these seats because they just go so well with the color of the car. And when you get inside it, it just feels very smart, very like sophisticated. I, I'm a big fan of this color. Taking a closer look, this car comes with a 9.2 inch touchscreen interface system, which has satellite navigation on it. The car also comes with Apple CarPlay. And now this specific uh, interface comes with a USB connection, a Bluetooth connection, an AUX connection, meaning you can play your music. Now this really does make the car feel up to date with uh, technology nowadays. So these seats are sports comfort seats. Now you do have the option of having heated seats, which in today's weather, you're not really gonna need, but come winter, perfect for, for this car. Um, this car also comes with a cruise control, meaning you can set a speed and let the car do its thing. It also has come with a speed limiter, meaning you can set yourself a speed and even if you floor the car, the car will only go up to that speed. You can even enjoy this car from sitting in the back. Firstly, I've got this lovely armrest with cup holders in which means I can just sit there and relax. This is a three-way climate control, meaning I can actually sit here and control how hot or how cold I want it, just with a click of a button. Also with a USB and a 12 volt cigarette lighter. Uh, this car also have these trays in the back, which means you can set them a different, different setting. So if I want to sit and have an iPad here or a laptop and watch something, I can. If I want to sit and have some food, I can raise it up even more and have my drinks on there. So this is like being in a limo, this from the back, it's lovely. It's got ambient lighting for when it's nice and dark and you can enjoy the, the panoramic roof, looking out to the stars or the blue sky, depending on what time of day it is. So this model has a full electronic display showing your rev counts, your speedo, um, your, your range until you need to fill up. It's, it's really smart, it's got everything on there. Um, it also comes with lane assist, meaning if you're on the motorway, for example, and you're starting to veer out of your lane, the car will correct itself and let you know that you are about to come out of your lane, which is more safer for yourself and for other drivers on the road.
So this car is front wheel drive and has a 2 litre TDI engine uh, running 148 brake horsepower with 340 newton metres of torque which is plenty for this car. Perfect for a family car if you just want to cruise along by long distances is perfect. So being a diesel this car is very economical. On average this car will get around 59 miles to the gallon. Uh, the estimated fuel range from a full tank is around 750 miles. The car um, costs around £150 for road tax a year and this car is in uh, insurance group number 17. So this car is, has been maintained to a very very good standard. This car only has one previous owner from new. Uh, I'm going to tell you more about how the car drives which is absolutely phenomenal. Being an SUV you're up high meaning you can see everything around you. The car is so comfortable to drive um, with the big tyres, the big profile of the tyres. Um, and inside it's just very modern, it's very smart. You just you look around and it's just like everything's up to date to what the car should be like. Um, and obviously the interior is lovely, it fits so well with this car. And being a manual just gets you more involved in the car as well. But this car is also perfect for having a family, if you want to cruise around, do long distances, especially being a diesel. And uh, as we're driving along now, the lane assist is actually kicking in, meaning if I do slowly get near to the edge of the line, the car will automatically just do its own thing. Meaning, I'm not saying you don't have to steer, but it will correct you if you are slightly coming out of your lane. So if you guys did like the video, please uh, hit the thumbs up and hit that notification. Oh, no, no, no. If you guys did like the video, please press the thumbs up button and hit the notification bell so you can be notified when we release more videos. Comment down below on what you thought about the car and what you thought about the review. And uh, yeah, we'll see you on the next one.